welcome to my third Minecraft video. My name is Volvic Foos, and I'll show you um, some more of my Minecraft builds in my world. I did say I was going to make a tutorial on how to build this ship, but I made it a very long time ago because, as I said, I was, you know, had to rearrange, rebuild, and just redo the ship entirely. So I kind of forgot how I built it. So I thought it'd be best just to maybe give you a schematic if you wanted it. So it's down in the downloads link be uh, below. So I. Uh, uh, please enjoy that. Over here, once this is put together as a server, this will be the spawn. It's called Fort Benton. Uh, this is the front main gate, as you can see. It's a very nice gate with two towers and like little dome uh, towers here that have fire in it, so you can use it like you know fire pit. Same with over there, you know for trash and all that if you wanted to. Uh, in the fort. Uh, or there's even three more towers just like these two surrounding the walls as you can see there's another one over there um, and I tried to make a pretty cool flag for the fort this I guess would then would be the flag so I hope that's pretty nice um, inside uh, this for starters this is a armory I honestly do not like this because just plain cobble uh, do, 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 mossy cobblestone doesn't look good at all. Originally, I was doing building this building on a different texture pack, and that texture pack it looked pretty good. But once I switched to this one, it doesn't look at all good. So I might just remodel it. You do not enter it, but if you find a switch, you're able to actually find or enter the doors of the armory and take what you want. So that'd be pretty cool. Next to the armory, we have a blacksmith, completely created by my brother Luckless Rogue. So this is his own design of the blacksmith, I believe. So it's it's pretty cool. Of course, down here you can use it. Uh, you have workbenches, furnaces, and all that. Upstairs, just storage. So there's really nothing much up here. Just storage. And more uh, furnaces. Outside, again, is just more furnaces. It's kind of like an outside <laughs> blacksmith, I guess. So that's pretty cool. It's like an add-on to the building. Looks pretty cool. Over here is a barracks, of course. In every fort, you need one. Uh, come in, the first thing in here is a mess hall. Over here, you'd probably get your food. And over there, you'd sit down anywhere you'd like. Over here we have stairs to go up to a tower and, of course, the second floor. And over here is the sleeping quarters. I have my beds green in this texture pack, so I thought maybe I'd make the floor kind of match it. So there we go. So we have bunk beds and chests for every bed, so it's pretty nice. Um, upstairs, like I said, is just uh, an open floor. You can kind of like come up here. Not real, well, You'd be able to hang out if this was like a real barracks. Hang out outside, I guess. And then upstairs is just a tower, which kind of overviews what you can see of trees <laughs> and um, snow on the other side of the fort. So if I go all the way back downstairs and out the front door here, or side door. Um, so this is what the, actually, this is what the building looks like. My brother thinks that the uh, wood there doesn't look as great as the rest of it, the birch wood, but please let me know what you think of that building. This building here, it would be the welcome center for my server. You'd spawn about right where I'm standing, and, well, of course, welcome center, so you'd be able to come in, welcome, and it's a list of rules and all that. In different places in the world. Of course, right now the building's kind of empty, but, so that'll be worked on hopefully soon. Again, this building was completely created by my brother because at the time I had no idea what to do for a welcome center because I really, well, just couldn't think of any design for it. So he completely built this building. It looks very well built and good design, especially with the glowstone. There's no torches in this building at all needed. So it's pretty well lit. The only thing he did not build was the roof. So I put together that roof. And I think it looks pretty cool with the design of the building. 
so this that's what's uh, the welcome, my welcome center or the, the server's welcome center. Back here we have the uh, fort train station. It's a pretty cool train station because you're able to get push this button on minecart comms lands you get in it and you push a button to your destination um and it's not completed because i don't have any destinations yet i mean i do but i need to create the tunnels leading to them so hopefully that'll be completed soon before this is up and running as a server and even if you wanted to you can live in here there's some townhouses back here so you can pick a townhouse and make it yours Here's another house in here. I just kind of put this together from another tutorial <laughs> that I was watching, so I built this house. And there's again another tower and another tower back here. And of course, like another, you have to have some ports for your fort, so I made a dock, and we have a ship with the dock and a chest full of boats so you can go out and uh, go ice fishing or go out into the w uh, wilderness with your boat and go off and free build. So that is the fort. So I hope uh, you all like that. Please leave a comment of what you think of the fort. Oh, and I do like to fly around a lot because it gets me around easier and for some reason when I turn off fly I don't know if I mentioned this in the my other two videos but um when I turn off fly and when I jump for some reason I jump really high and when I land I almost die if anyone knows what's the problem with that or if someone can f find out how to fix that please let me know I mean I tried, I, I deleted the mod, uh, I re-downloaded the mod and put it all back together, but it just didn't work out. It still makes me jump really high and, for some reason. Now I wanted to show you this because this is uh, a build I just finished, or recently finished. It is a Minecraft mansion, or my, my Minecraft mansion. It is a very nice build and pretty big. It has three chimneys. Uh, five fireplaces in total, so it's pretty cool. If you ever watch Tykin's videos, uh, you will definitely recognize this. Inside, here is uh, my recreation of his, um, well, room, his main room here. Uh, his living room. Uh, for some reason I couldn't think of that word. This is like his fireplace and his um, couch and chairs and table. I watched a few of his videos and I thought his house is very cool, so I wanted to try to recreate uh, one of his like little rooms or so. And this was the most one that I keep seeing or saw, and I liked the most, so I decided to put it together. And on the west east side of the house we have a of course the fireplace there a nice library which with a like a big open window back here so you can see some nice rooms uh, and on the other side on the west side of the house we have the kitchen and the dining room which looks pretty cool I think and it as well goes with some storage upstairs is four bedrooms uh, on this side of the house, the back side, this bedroom and this bedroom look alike, and same with the ones in the front. And here's what the room looks like. Nice fireplace, a nice bedroom, a nice overview of a few buildings outside. And same with the one on this side, so it looks pretty cool. And that's all for the house, because this side or that side is exactly the same. Well, that's all for my uh, third Minecraft video, so I hope you all liked uh, what you saw, my fort, and uh, this pretty cool mansion. So please com leave a comment, and that would be much obliged. Thank you for watching.